Question five, match each sheep on the left to one with equal area on the right. What has been done for you? Well, before we do anything, let's think about what the areas of each sheep actually are. Well, the shapes on the right are easy because they are made up of complete squares. So this first shape is one square. So it has an area of one. This has got an area of two squares, three squares, four squares, five squares, and six squares, seven squares. So that's nice and easy. The shapes on the left aren't so easy. What the shapes on the left contain are halves of squares. So what you've got to remember is that two half squares equals a whole square. So let's start thinking about the shapes on the left. So this first shape here has got one whole square there, two whole squares. These two triangles together, these two halves make three whole squares, and these two together make four whole squares, which is why this shape is joined to four. The second shape, these two bits here are two halves, halves of squares. The two triangles put together make a whole square. So those two together make one whole one, and these two together will make two whole ones. So this is two whole squares. So this shape has got to be joined to two whole squares, like that. Moving on down, gets a little bit harder. So We've got one whole square, two whole squares, three whole squares, four whole squares. These two together will make five whole squares. These two together will make six whole squares. And these two together will make seven whole squares. So this shape needs to be joined to seven. The final one, the same technique applies. So these two together make one, these two together make two, these two together make three, these two together make four, and these two together make five. So that shape needs to be joined to five whole squares. And there you have it. Let's just zoom out so we can see the whole page. And that's what you should have done to complete that question.